For months after the hype train for For Honor died out, I was hearing about this little game called Absolver. I was told it was going to be the game that would kill For Honor and show us what For Honor was supposed to be, and this and that. And now after playing Absolver for a week straight, hitting the current level cap, reaching rank 50 in combat trials, and creating my own school, and refighting the bosses for what they had to offer, I can say that the claims that Absolver would put For Honor to shame are false. Now don't get me wrong, I absolutely love Absolver, especially when it comes to fighting. But I can't say that it's the For Honor killer simply because they're two completely different games. So For Honor and Absolver are both third person fighting games, they both have a unique stance based combat system, and they both have steep learning curves that reward you for understanding the game. But that's basically it. Absolver's combat system is very polished and I'm surprised that such a small development team managed to make a fighting game that's this balanced. Sure there are a few moves that you know some will consider strong like the whirlwind double punch, but there's nothing in the game that feels like a flickered Orochi zone attack. The four combat styles are different, but they're mainly there for the defensive properties since all the moves can be learned by any class. The duels in Absolver look very pretty and almost cinematic as you sidestep uppercuts and jump over leg sweeps just before they dislocate your ankles. There's tons of different attacks in the game, some that have different properties like jumping over low attacks or being able to absorb one hit. And with these moves come the ability to craft your own combat deck and create your own combos, and that's where Absolver really shines. Sure, learning new moves feels a bit grindy, but it's definitely worth it. Losing a fight against a skilled opponent never makes you feel cheated unless it's super laggy. Instead, it makes you feel like you were outplayed and didn't do what you had to do to win the fight. So I have nothing but good things to say about the combat, but the game itself isn't perfect. I know the game was made by like 6 people and I know it's only $30, but there are still problems the game has. The biggest problem being the servers. Now, the servers have been a little spotty. There are times when you simply can't play online and have to play offline and fight against the AI and bosses the world has to offer. My entire first day was spent beating the game without encountering another prospect. The downtime is supposedly getting fixed this Friday, so hopefully the servers will stay up. Another big issue a lot of people were having was that their save files were being corrupted, and they would lose hours of progress unless they save their game to the cloud. Now fortunately, I never had this problem, so I was a little lucky again, but a fix will be coming for that on Friday as well. Those are the two, you know, big technical problems I had. There is a minor glitch where the audio would stack and make the game sound really glitchy, but that's not really a big deal to me since you can fix that by resetting your game. As for the gameplay, as I said before, the combat is great, but the PvE part of the game is lacking. There's no incentive for traveling around and fighting other absolvers in the open world. And the only other thing to do is to search for loot or fight the 10 or 11 bosses the game has to offer. Now yes, you can argue with me that the game is not about the campaign, it's about the combat trials. But even in combat trials, there isn't too much to do other than to chase rank 50 so you can create your own school. Slowclap plans on adding more game modes to PvP and new gear and whatnot to scratch the PvE itch, but honestly, I don't know when it's going to be implemented. Is Absolver the For Honor killer? No. Is Absolver a great game? Yes. If you enjoy fighting games, Absolver is great to just pick up and have fun. You won't get salty or upset over cheese, it's just fun. There's really no rank or anything to strive for yet, which is why I'm putting it down for a while and going to go frustrate myself in For Honor's dual tournaments. In a couple months when Absolver has more to do in its world, I'll definitely return. Anyways, that's all I have to say, I just wanted to talk about Absolver for once. Tell me how you feel about it. Have you tried Absolver? And if so, do you like it or do you find it boring? Also, feel free to leave a like if you enjoyed the video and sub if you're new. And I will talk to you guys in the next video.